Hello everyone, you might be trying to figure out how you can screen record on your M2 MacBook Pro. So whether you have the M2 Pro one or the M2 one or whichever MacBook you have, they're all, they all pretty much work the same exact way. So in order to screen record, what you want to do is you want to go ahead and basically get into the panel in which you want to screen record. So if you want to screen record starting here, or if you want to screen record in a certain application, you can go and boot up that app like this, and that is the first thing I recommend doing. Now the next thing you want to do is you want to go ahead and open up your QuickTime application. So what you can do is you can pretty much just type in QuickTime just like this. So you can just open up the QuickTime application. And then when you do it, you won't be able to see it sometimes. But if you look on the top left, you should be able to see QuickTime Player. So now all you want to do is you want to go and click on File down here. And you want to go and click on New Screen Recording. So once you do that, you will get into this panel. Now you can go ahead and you have a few options here. For one, you can go and you know make this bounding box bigger. So if you wanted to go ahead and basically screen record only this portion, well, it's going to screen record what's in this box and not on the outside. If you want to screen record the complete display, you can click this little button down here, which is right here, and it'll record basically everything on your display. Now, you can also go ahead and what I would highly recommend doing is clicking this options button down right here. So click on options. When you do that, you will come into this panel. Now, this panel is going to you know, tell you exactly where you can save your screen recordings at. So we can you know, save them straight onto our desktop. A timer, basically if you want to count down from five or 10 seconds, you can go and do that. In this case, I just usually leave it at none. And microphone. So if you want to talk while you're screen recording, let's say you want to do a lecture, or you're talking or whatever, well, you want to go ahead and make sure you either have your MacBook Pro microphone or you at least have another microphone enabled so you can go and choose it. A lot of people start screen recordings without checking that. So just keep that in mind. If you don't want to talk or don't want to say anything, then don't worry about it. But that is another massive thing. Now you can also show a floating thumbnail and remember last selection, all this other stuff. But those are the main things you want to do. Now when you're ready, all you want to do is go and click record. And that is it. The recording will then record and you'll know it's recording because in the top right button right here, there's going to be a little record button. So you can go and record whatever you want to. And then whenever you're done, what you want to do is you want to go and click on that recording button. And when you do that, you will see that the recording just you know is what it is. Now you can save it, you can exit out of it and delete it. But that is pretty much how it's done. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.